All right, you guys, here we are. It's Wednesday and it's time for the TR Challenge. And this week, we are gonna talk about trajectory. That's right. You can see here one of my favorites, Blaze and the Monster Machines. You know, I read about them all the time over here. You wanna read about Blaze? That's my one. Just so you guys know, Blaze has a lot of trajectory, which means it is an object that's flying through the air by a force, right? So an object that's flying through the air. Darrington is a stunt truck. He loves jumping ramps mm -hmm. that give him trajectory that sail <laughs> through the air. So today, we are going to create an egg launch. You will need an egg. I think I'll choose uh, this one. All right, let's see. There are so many ways to create an egg launch. However, I just used some simple things that I had at home, some popsicle sticks, rubber bands, a couple of plastic spoons, and of course, a good old Easter egg. However, you can use a real one, but be ready for a big mess. So, this challenge, what we want you to do is to see how far your object can go, right? The trajectory of that object. So, I'll tell you, I've been practicing. Mine goes up pretty far, but not so much out. So, let's see what happens now. Getting my egg launch ready for blast off. The egg is in place. One, two, three, go! And there you have it. Pretty good, I would say. So there are so many ways that you can create an egg launch. Be creative, use what you have. We can't wait to see what you do. As Elaine explained, each egg launch can be different depending on what you have. As you can see, I've used an egg carton, rubber bands, and a spoon for my trajectory. Egg ready. Launch ready. Indy, ready? Okay, Mr. Egg. Two, one. Yes! We made it to the hammock! Ta-da! Sneak attack. Launch ready.